niggers are the larva of the red mite, the little plant eating, usually harmless little bug that runs every once in a while to latch onto a lizard or a frog or something. That's not what we got to worry about. We got to worry about the spawn of the red mite, the chigger. They're not prejudiced. They don't care if it's wet or if it's dry. They exist. They crawl around just waiting for something to latch onto. The larva need a host to feed off of. They can feed off of a dog, a chicken, a cat, a human, whatever. The larva, the ones that cause the problem, you can't see them. But mom and daddy, they're pretty easy to spot. They're small. I mean, they're like half a millimeter. But if you see a bunch of little tiny red dots crawling around, chances are really good you're going to find chiggers. And you don't want chiggers. If you happen to be allergic to them, it is horrible. There were chiggers right there. He was, he's not allergic. I'm allergic. An allergy to chiggers is a horrible thing to go through. And 80 something chigger bites. My reaction got so extreme that it inflamed my joints. See, there's the baby eggs and then, see that little tiny thing that, I mean, he's a tenth the size of his mom and daddy over here so you can't see him he just crawls up there and sticks his little straw in your leg and goes to eating and puking and then yeah here's a close up this is like a real picture magnified picture that's a chigger chiggers are bad they're not any kind of host specific this is one of the things they kind of like to feed on, you know, through their entire life cycle. They don't become a real problem for us because, you know, feeding off dead skin or dead plant matter or whatever is not a big deal. It's when they're looking to get that boost of liquid and stuff they need to become an adult where they start being a parasite is the problem. Perithrin. Spray your yard.